Hello guys, it's the guide here, and uh, today I will be showing you how to play Quake 3 on your Windows 8 computer. Um, as you can see, I have it on here, um, and I will show you it working. So, what you're going to have to do is, um, depending on... Now, this is for Steam, so I got it off of Steam, so I'll load it up. And go to Library. Okay, so now that you're in your library, you're going to go and click on the Quake 3 Arena. Um, and then you're going to right click and go to Properties. And uncheck Enable the Steam Overlay while in game. And uh, then do that for Quake 3 Team Arena too. Go to Properties and then don't enable it. Uh, so this is without having to download a bunch of other stuff just to get this torque on the eight. And then I'm going to show you the rest in uh, Quake 3. Okay, I am back in um, Quake 3 Team Arena. So it doesn't matter if you do this in Quake 3 or Quake 3 Team Arena. It's still going to work either way. Okay, so um, what you're going to need to do is... Um, it like this. As you can see, I still I can't use the whole width of my screen. It's just a box on my screen. And I'm going to show you how to make it widescreen, fill up your whole screen in this part. So, um, go ahead and click the, like, it's like a squiggly line and it's in between the tab and escape buttons. Uh, it's under escape, both tab. So, click that and it should bring down the console like this. Now you're going to type this and I'll I'll probably show you in the description. Okay, so click R, or type R, underscore, mode, and then minus one. And then I'll tell you that we changed upon restarting. And then you're going to, um, yeah, I didn't, and it doesn't really matter if you put a slash, but I'll just do it anyways. Go to R, underscore, custom, width. And then right here is where you're going to put um, the width in pixels of your screen. So there's mine is 1600. Then click enter. Then slash r custom height. And then you're going to enter in the height of your screen. So if this, in this case, mine is 900. Click enter. Then you're going to say slash r, and then you're going to go underscore custom aspect 1. Now this one you have to put custom aspect 1. You can't really change that. And then slash, and then you're going to say slash vid underscore restart. And then that should do it. Okay, so um, yeah, I've done that. And as you can see, it's full widescreen. Um, and you can try it on yours, it works. So, uh, I just had to get to work on Windows 8 and make it widescreen. So, let's go ahead and I'll show you how it works. So, we're going to play, single player, and then, and as you can see, it doesn't really stretch it that bad. It's not like, it doesn't look distorted and stuff, it actually still looks good. Um, so, let's go and select this one. And then I was going to enter arena. It's loading. We did. So now the game starts in 13. So you can see. Shoot. Ground. Point. And uh, play this awesome game on Windows 8. So I will won't be posting some gameplay videos on YouTube. Um, this is a very fun game. It's made nineteen ninety nine, but still really fun. The nail gun. Actually, I haven't actually used this gun that much. Paint. So, anyways. So anyways, that's about it for um, this video. 
And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video.